cybersecurity uh, evolved very uh, quickly in recent years uh, due, due to the classification of uh, rail industry as a critical infrastructure. We can see more and more uh, standardizations that are mainly related to rail, uh, the rail industry. You can see the technical specification TS5701, uh, IEC 62443, that was adapted by the rail industry as non-rails uh, related and now it's merged into a new standard and, and, and the line standard. The CSA, TSA uh, directives and other initiatives that push the market forward. You can see also that the whole ecosystem, the vendors and the sub suppliers are related to cybersecurity as a very important topic uh, for customers. Yes, as you are saying, the railway industry is made of several stakeholders. We have operators, we have manufacturers, we have third party suppliers bringing new solutions like Silus. And all of that ecosystem needs to move forward and to change towards cybersecurity. Mm -hmm. The right mindset is there, so we are seeing more and more people being interesting, have understood why they need to protect themselves. But we shall not underestimate the magnitude of the change. It's a big cultural change that we need to bring in the industry, moving from a very safety-related industry where things were frozen more or less, to something which is more adjusted to the changes in front of us. So, of course, the challenge is big, but the change has started and we will contribute to it.